Oh, who wants some of the candy from Chalky? Ooh, I want some. Mmm. Yummy. I can't wait to eat more space sweets at the party and dance. Um, children. Wow. <laughs> Welcome back! The presents look great, Billy. Now we just have to wait for Tim and Calc's presents. Hey, guys. Wow, are all these presents for me? But it's not my birthday. <laughs> no, Tim. Today's Astrid's birthday. Remember? Huh? Hello, children. Astrid's birthday is next week, but join us in outer space tonight for her surprise party. Oh, I see. Thanks, Calc. We're just making sure we have all our presents before we leave. We have one present from me, a second present from Billy, then a third present from Chalky, and a fourth present from Calc. Now, we just need your present, Tim. Where is it? Uh, I, I have it, but, but it's a surprise. Oh, I'm sure Astrid will love it. Yeah, I hope so. Well, then let's go to outer space. These gems are so pretty. Hello, children. Thanks for coming. Hi, Mr. Astronaut. What place is this? We are at the Space Gem Park. These gems don't grow just anywhere, so this park allows everyone in the galaxy to visit and enjoy them. So it's like a garden, but with space gems instead of flowers. So, are you kids ready for Astrid's party? We're really excited. Tim even prepared a surprise for Astrid. Huh? <laughs> uh, yeah, I sure did. I'm sure Astrid will like it, Tim. <laughs> that sounds like Astrid. <laughs> Quick, let's hide. What took you so long, Tim? Shh! She's getting closer! Hmm. I thought I heard Dad's voice. Surprise! Hey, guys! You're all here! Happy birthday, Astrid! We've prepared a party for you. But first, we have some presents. A party? And presents? The first present is from me. Open it! <gasps> Crayons! I've always wanted these. Thanks, Paula. The second and third presents are from Chalky and me. Wow. Thanks, guys. This fourth present is from Calc. Aw, Calc. Thank you. And finally, the fifth present is a surprise from Tim. Uh, yes. Ta-da! <gasps> Is that a space gem from the park? Um, uh, yes. I took it from the space gem park. Didn't you prepare a surprise at home? Actually, I forgot about the party, so I didn't have a present. Then I saw the gems and I thought Astrid would like one. You can't just pick a gem from the park like that. But I only picked one gem. But if everyone who visits the park picks one gem, there would be no more for anyone to enjoy. You should put it back, Tim. We'll go with you. Okay.
Um, hello. Enjoying the park? I'm sorry, guys. It's okay, Tim. And I'm sorry, Astrid. I guess I don't have a present for you after all. Don't sweat it, Tim. It's the thought that counts. All right, then. It's about time we get to the party. To the space train! <laughs> so what did we learn? We were invited to Astrid's birthday party, but Tim forgot to get Astrid a present. When he saw the pretty gems at the space park, he took one to give to Astrid. When we go somewhere and see something nice, what should you do? Should we take it? Or should we leave it for others to enjoy? That's right! We should always leave it for others to enjoy. Let's learn how to write. Number three. Draw a curve and do it again. That's how you get number three. A traffic light has three colors and a triangle has three sides. Before you cross, always remember to look to your left and right. Draw a curve and do it again. And that's how you write number three. Whoa! Look at all these aliens! Yes, the space train is always crowded. Because it's an easy way to get around in the galaxy. Oh! Who wants some of the candy from Chalky? Ooh, I want some! Mmm! Yummy! I can't wait to eat more space sweets at the party and dance! Um, children! Whoa! <gasps> I can't drive the space train with all these distractions. We're sorry, Mr. Driver. Hug and Choggy were just excited. I know, but this is a public space. What's a public space? Well, a public space is a space that is for everyone to use. We must be respectful and share the space with others. This is how you share a public space with others. Step 1. Clean up after yourselves. Step 2. Don't make too much noise. Step 3. Respect the space of others. And that's how you share a public space with others. We need to show that we can share a public space with others. Go on, Chalky. Try step 1. Clean up after yourself. Good job! Wait, Calc! Remember step two? Don't make too much noise! S guys! Remember step three! Respect the space of others! Excellent! Now I can finally continue driving! Hooray! <laughs> This was the best party ever! The space food was so yummy! The ice cream was my favorite! Oh, I shouldn't shout. <laughs> Don't worry, Tim. We're not in a public space right now. We can make some noise in our playroom! <laughs> <laughs> Do join us on our next adventure! Number of the day! Five, Five presents! presents.
five gems. Dance with 